Now, if you try to run the simulation, you will face an error message because the time action library is not supported. And I will teach you how to add not just the time action library, but any other library to Tinkercad so that you can easily use it in simulation. Now, this is the solution to this problem because Tinkercad, as you can see here, only support these libraries. And in order to add any other library, you have to add it manually. So let's go back to our code and remove this line. Now let's close this. We need to wait for the initialization. Now remove the time or the include library, which is the missing library here. Now add a space here. First, you need to go to your library and unzip it. You will find these files. The first file that we are interested in is the .hex file. Right click, edit, and copy the whole code. Now, as you can see, this code is commented and the code at the beginning, all of this is commented. So we only need this code. Now copy that. Go back here, paste. After doing that, the next thing that you need to do is go back. And if there's a .cpp file, you need to right click, edit. And as you can see, it has a lot of lines. We need to copy all of them. Copy. Go back here and paste it under the first one. Now, if you found anything that's commented, you need to remove it. Just to make sure that we can easily solve any mistakes or any errors. Remove this include line. Go back, remove this include line. Now, let's click start simulation. As you can see, the simulation is running. The LED is turning on and off, but we don't see any text on the LCD display. That's because we have a wrong connection here. Let's move this. Now start simulation. And here it is. The LED is turning on and off. The backlight is dimming. And we are getting different text messages on the first line. And the variable is incrementing on the second line. So we are doing three tasks at the very same time. And this was an explanation for how to test out your code and how to add a library even if Tinkercad does not support it. We, here we added the timed action library, but what we did here, you can do it with any other library. Just copy the text inside the .h file and the .cpp file, remove unnecessary includes, and run the simulation. Thanks for watching this lesson. This is Asher from Educational Engineering Team.